Welcome Team Thieves and welcome, it's Kathleen from Cause Creations. Welcome to the No Bras and Number 2 guys. I am happy to be here. I came down here to kind of keep myself awake. <laughs> My mom flies into town tonight and um, I'm usually an early to bed, early to rise kind of girl. I'm up at 5 a.m. every morning, partially due to the fact that uh, I owned a landscaping company for 30 years and I had to get up early. And uh, I still get up like clockwork without an alarm at 5 a.m. So I came down to paint while I'm killing time before I need to go pick my mama up from the airport. So thanks for joining me. Thanks for help keeping me up. <laughs> we are working today on a reused 24 by 24 inch gallery wrap canvas. And I did something a little different. The paint, the uh, painting that I did on here, it did not dry really well. And that happens every once in a while. Now, I know why it didn't dry well. Um, in the studio next to me, they had a, um, a heater running. And um, it kind of affected the... Um, the temperatures here in my studio and it dried too quickly and it had a just a small amount of cracking but it bugged the hell out of this girl so um, I decided to paint over it but what I did was I just brush painted to kind of fill in the three little areas that they had the cracking in with my uh, Artist Loft Soft Body Acrylics in White, straight out of the bottle, guys. So I don't know if that's gonna do anything here or not. So it's kind of acting like um, gesso, I guess, to my canvas. Now our colors today are interesting and simple. I'm going to be doing many, many layers <laughs> in this cup and doing a traveling ring pour. And I'm excited about these colors. Look at this, guys, isn't that beauteous? Now, I don't use, let's talk about what that is. That is golden iridescent bronze, and it is a lovely, glorious, beautiful bronze. I don't use a lot of it because depending on what colors you marry with this, it tends to take on a green hue. And that's okay sometimes, but I don't want a green hue in this painting. Now, all our paints are creamy thick. As Mina taught me, there's a sweet spot there where it just glides off that popsicle stick into the paint below. These are much thicker than what I'm used to using kind of like uh, shampoo. A nice rich shampoo is how it lands in that cup below. So there's our bronze. All these paints today are mixed with the same pouring medium. Where the heck did I put it? There it is. We are using Sweet Krista's Mix Pour. I like this when I'm doing my ring pours because you need a thicker paint to sew or your straight pours, you need a thicker paint and a thicker pouring medium. And Krista does a wonderful job with this, guys. The link to how to get this is in the description box, but some people are confused about it. There is not a website. You have to email Krista. Her email address will be in the description box. Reach out to her. She's good people. She's also a wonderful artist and she will take really good care of you. In this cup right here, we have golden fluids in the carbon black. Now, this did not take as much water um, as my next paint because it's a fluid paint and it's already thinner than most two paints. Um, what else here? Oh, in this cup, more of the Artist Loft White in the soft body acrylics. And in this yummy cup right here, we have a combination of my golden iridescent gold in the high flow. This is the thinnest of all the golden paints. The high flow is thinner than the fluid paint. And um, I was at my first visit to Blix 
about a year ago and their high flow paints were 50% off which is a tremendous bargain so I bought up all kinds of high flow paints but I mix that with Chroma Molten Metals Xanadu Gold because I wanted a bolder gold against this black, white, and bronze color palette. All paints mixed with Mix Pour. Different paints got different amounts of water. The high flow paint got less water than the chroma paint. So the water is the key factor here, guys, with your consistency. Let's take a look at that consistency again. A nice creamy mound, kind of like a nice rich shampoo that you're pouring into the palm of your hand. So I need to practice with my thicker paints. Um, I like my thin paints. Oh gosh, guys, I just like paints, all kinds of paints, thick paints, <laughs> thin paints. Um, two other colors we have, Artist Loft Black in the high flow and Artist Loft White in the, I'm sorry, Artist Loft Black in the soft body is what they call it now, and Artist Loft White in the soft body acrylic paints. In case we want to add a little bit of negative space into this painting. So I'm excited, guys. I am going to layer my cup off camera because I want to do a lot and a, a lot of very precise layers. And uh, because this canvas is wet, I cannot do it on top. So I will be right back at you guys. Going to put some tunes on so you can dance around while you're waiting. <laughs> Don't you know that I would 
drive Do you know I'm looking? Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights And I I really wanna know, really wanna know If I Will ever figure out where the road goes Even if I'm falling down I will keep on searching for my highs I lost my mind I will keep on holding my head high Even if the sky is falling down Jumping from cliffs so high Trusting our wings to fly Sometimes we're crashing down But we get up and start from the ground You don't know I'm looking with you every 